lovely, wonderful people, it's happening. Yes, so INEC reverses stand set to transmit Bayesa Imo Kogi results of the election. So the electronical um, results was, you know, INEC initially, you know, they have a right to tell Nigerians how they intend to transmit results. They initially have, you know, raised and have said they would do it in a particular way. But guess what? They are the same people who are changing and who are changing things right now, taking it to the other level, saying, no, we'll not do this. We want it in another way, in another form. Yes, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details as INEC change from pillar to post trying to, you know, to, to, to mix words. INEC reverses standards and stands set up to transmit election results in Bayesa, Imo, and Kogi. Results electronically, um, they are reversing and saying some other things. The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has said that the result of the November 11 governorship election in Bayesa, Imo, and Kogi State will be transmitted electronically. Politics Nigeria reports that INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakub made this clarification on Saturday while monitoring a mock election in Lokoja, Kogi State. He said the method is so as to provide so as to provide guidance. The method is, uh, provi is provided by law for INEC to say how they will go about transmitting of election results and electronic uploadment of the results on the INEC viewing portal, IREV portals. And that is why we are doing this mock. Yakub urged results registered voters to check the uh, the IREV portal in the next two hours to see the results of the mock election from all three states. According to him, security agencies have given assurance of adequate security on election day in all of the states. Well, so far so good in terms of accuracy and the security agencies, we can see they have, they have been here and the mock election has gone very well. Next Friday, there is going to be a high-level meeting in Abuja, chaired by myself and the National Security Advisor, in which all security agencies will be present to discuss the issue of security for the next three states. So we are here and we are on top of the situation in terms of security arrangement, security development, Yakub clarification came after the Bayesa State Registr Re 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 Resident Electoral Commissioner Earthlong recently said that the commission would adopt a manual mode of, trans of transmission of election results. So initially, INEC told Nigerians that it's going to be, you know, um, uh, a manual transmission of election results. But Yakub came now and said no. They will do it electronically. It will not be a manual transmission of election results. So everybody is waiting patiently to see what we follow. And uh, we all need to now know that um, we'll not allow things to just be that way. We will rise up and we ensure that things are done properly, decently and in order. Because as it stands, Nigerians, we need, you know, Yakub will have to live up to his name. Mm, because already he's, he's, he's on high alert. The whole world is watching him. Now, these states are states that they have by elections because they are not in the um, normal election cycle as a result of, you know, things that have happened in the states while elections were going on. So every single person is beginning to watch very carefully and see how these things are playing out. And everybody's wondering what the next line of points and action will be. So it is important that we all pay great attention in all of these areas and understand what's going on, you know. So initially they said it was going to be manual transmission of election results. 
but it's going to be changing it to become you know it's not going to be manually more it's going to be electronic transmission and they had a mock you know a mock kind of uh you know election result to see how these things will be so everybody is watching and we all know that you know it's not it's no longer business as usual and we hope that you know Yakub will be able to live up to something because right now nigerians i can assure you for free do not have any form of trust in INEC. like a single trust of trust in INEC is terrible you know so i don't know if personally i personally this is me or personal opinion i don't feel like coming out to vote what's the point of voting this is me speaking personally i'm not saying you should not to is your civic responsibility you should do it you know but when you when you you're like me and you're feeling like you come out to vote and the and the election is not credible at the end of the day the same result you guys stayed and counted by the time the result is read is a different number and you are wondering did i miss something was i in a dream was it real what happened you know you it, it, it's it's called discouragement okay in the whole system together it's called a series of discouragement and that's what most nigerians feel but again we cannot give up it is our country we must do something about it we cannot leave them to it even if it, even if i don't feel like going to vote i will still vote because that's how we determine our leaders if you don't do it, they will take advantage, they will take opportunity, they will take, they will take it from your hands and they will bring up their own people. And at the end of the day, you know, you will not be happy with what follows. And so whether we like it or not, we will still have to come out and vote. So from here, our encouragement to you all, wherever you are, is that you should please just one more time, have faith, come out and vote. One more time, do something worthwhile. I know it looks like you know you can't trust them anymore. You are you are saying I, I should still trust. Yes, you just have to do something about it. You just have to brace up yourself and know that yes, we can. You know, yes, we can. You have to just make up your mind and say, you know what, we can do something about it rather than leaving yourself to chance. You know, so these are very very important matters. Now they are telling us they will electronically transmit results. Later they will change their mind. God help us. Leave us a comment. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Have a good day. Bye for now.